Today we are going to be making these really cute patriotic shooting star treat cups. Now these are perfect for any patriotic holiday like Memorial Day, Veterans Day, Independence Day, Flag Day, really the list goes on and on. We're going to be cutting these out using our Cricut and I have this SVG file available for you to download absolutely free. So make sure and check the description of this video for that information. Hi everyone, I am Katie, the Crafty Vlog Stalker, and if you're new to my videos, make sure to subscribe and ring that bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming tutorials. Our supplies that we're going to use today are red, white, and blue cardstock, double-sided tape roller, glue, star, treat cup, some red, white, and blue M&Ms, a Cricut cutting machine, and our Shooting Star SVG design. I've already got my design uploaded into Cricut Design Space. Now I do not want to size this file at all because if I change the sizing, it'll affect how it fits around those star treat cups. So I want to keep the file as is and click on Make It. I have my Cricut all ready to go and I'm going to follow the prompts in Cricut Design Space to know which color of cardstock to load into my machine. We have got all of our pieces cut and now we're going to start assembling. We're going to start with our base piece and the first thing we're going to glue on is the stripes. And I'm going to use some liquid glue for the star piece since it's a little bit more intricate and I need to get glue there in between those stripes. And we're just gonna line this up against the top. And press that into place. So there's our first layer, and actually I'm gonna add just a little bit more glue there to the tip. There we go. And there is our star stripe. Now we're going to move to our red stripe. And with this one, we can use the tape runner. I prefer tape runners when it comes to paper crafts because it's much quicker. You don't have to wait for dry time. But for some of the pieces, we need a liquid glue. And again, we're just going to line that up with the bottom. And there we have our stripes. We're gonna grab our star, and the first thing we're gonna wanna do is turn that over and put a handful of M&Ms in there. And of course you have to use the red, white, and blue ones. Now if you really wanted to, you could turn all the M's over. And this white piece right here is our backing piece. And to secure that, we're gonna use our tape runner. And we're just gonna add some tape around the edges of that star treat cup. Okay, and then we're going to take that star and we're going to center it over the back. And there is our treat cup. Isn't that so cute? And then we're gonna take our tape runner and we're gonna add some more tape to the back of that treat cup. And then we're going to center this, the treat cup, on our white backing sheet here. and press that into place. Oh, it's so cute already. Okay, and then we've got our finishing pieces to kind of hide up that treat cup or the edges of the treat cup. So for this one, we can use our tape runner again. And go all the way around that star. And 
place our blue star on top. Now with our red star, we since it's a little bit thinner, again, we're going to bring in our liquid glue. and center that on our blue star. There we go. And there is our 4th of July, or really any patriotic holiday, treat cup. Isn't that so stinking cute? I wanna thank you so much for joining me today. While you're here, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming tutorials. And of course, you can always find me at my home base at thecraftyblogstalker.com. Thanks everybody. Bye and happy crafting.